What's up guys, Wade here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to connect a wireless Bluetooth mouse to your iPad. So first off, you're going to want to make sure that your iPad is jailbroken. Um, if you don't know how to do that, I'll have a link in the underbar to a video that will show you how to do it. So go ahead and open up Cydia. Once you have that open, you're going to want to search for an application called BT Stack Mouse. Go ahead and install that, and uh, when you install it, it's going to install everything that you'll need for the application to work, all the plugins and all the other packages. So once that's installed, you're going to notice a new icon called Mouse. Go ahead and open that up. And you're going to want to get your mouse ready. Just for the purpose of this video, I'll be using um, my Mighty Mouse from my computer. And you'll notice it'll start searching for Bluetooth devices and uh, it will activate Bluetooth on your iPad. Um, so what you're going to want to do, uh, if you have a Mighty Mouse, you're going to want to turn it off, turn it back on again. You'll notice a green light and uh, you'll also notice that Apple Wireless Mouse will come up on the devices. Go ahead and select that and it should lead you to a screen like this. So say go to settings to configure mouse speed if you want to configure it. And um, that's basically it. You'll notice that there's now a mouse on your screen and um, you can control it right from this mouse. As you can see, I'm just controlling it. Um, the controls are pretty simple. Um, left click to select something and then right click to go back to the home screen. And um, you can scroll back and forth on the pages and uh, open up an icon if you want. And um, you also notice that in, in settings there's a new um, option for the mouse so you can control the mouse speed and the different buttons. So that's basically it. Um, pretty simple, pretty handy tool um, for those of you who don't want to use the touch screen. Um, the touch screen does still work, so you still have that option. Um, but you also now have the option to use the mouse. So there you go. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to post a comment or send me a message, and I'll do my best to try and answer them. And I will see you in the next video.